Uh, this is a song that I wrote uh, one night in a fit of something. I don't know. Uh, I'd been on the road for 21 days on a record promotional tour, and uh, I'd been to 18 different cities. And uh, when I got home to Nashville after that, uh, I didn't know whether I was scratching my watch or winding my fanny. I was a little bit... Got another one. Uh, I was a little bit berserko. So I sat around in a fit of depression, I guess, and wrote this song trying to get my poo-poo back in perspective. And it's called Ode to the Road, and it's very clever, and you're going to have to listen real good because I wrote it awful well. <laughs> Sang the heck out of it now. I'm afraid I'm just a figment of my own imagination Cause only someone just like me could ever dream me up that usually gets a chuckle. Thank you, man. Thank you. We did it. Only someone just like me could ever dream me up. <laughs> Courtesy laughter. Thank you. I'm a 14-carat cuckoo, living color animation. A cross between the silver chalice and the Dixie cup. That's better. <laughs> Wherever you are, Mr. Serling, I believe that I'm a sterling example of the twilight zone you used to rave about. I've been a picking and a grinning 30 days without a day off. I've given and I've given till I'm afraid I'm plumb give out. I'm getting weirder by the minute from the things I ain't been smoking and reality is blowing me away. I've been searching for me everywhere from Vegas to Hoboken. And if you see me, kindly tell me I went that way. You see, all my bread ain't hardly done. And if it were, I'd still be one brick shy of the number it takes to make up a load. My hair just died of jet lag, and I'm zipped inside my hanging bag. So check this bag of Nashville Porter. God, I love the road. Thank you very much. Uh, I was in Dallas one night. This didn't have anything to do with the song, but y'all are giggling, so I thought I'd throw it in. I was in Dallas, Texas with Roger Miller. I don't know whether that's for Roger or Dallas. It's for Dallas. What do you got against Roger? <laughs> no, we think we were in Dallas. Uh, we ain't real sure. Uh, we're so high we've gone duck hunting with a rake. <laughs> no, we, I just kid. We're just sitting around picking and drinking some Coke Colas and stuff, you know. <laughs> and Roger has this game he plays with me. He, uh, he'll make up the first line of a song and just kind of throw it at me and see if I got enough gear to come back with something, you know. So we're sitting there and Roger said, don't fall in love with anyone from Cleveland if they've been known to have strong family ties. I don't know. So I said, if the doctor says you got a week to live, go live in Cleveland. It'll seem like a year before you die. Y'all been to Cleveland? <laughs> it's great. Actually, I uh, I wrote the second verse of this song about a small place in New Mexico called Tucumcari. Real garden spot. The Tucumcari of the Great Southwest, Sarah, man. That's it. The Cleveland of the Great Southwest is Tucumcari. It's the only place in the world you can stand in mud up to your butt and dust blowing your eyes. <laughs> That's where the Greyhound bus stops and the dog gets off and takes a leak. Right. I know right now this song ain't going on TV. I got Tomaine in a tavern down in Tucum Carry Tuesday. And Wednesday I got welded to a socket on the wall. Plugging in my amplifier, the whole darn thing caught on fire. Living better electrically ain't where it's at after all. I'm getting weirder by the minute from the things I ain't been smoking, and reality is blowing me away. I've been searching for me everywhere from Vegas, no boating. And 
if you can see me, kindly tell me I went that way. You see, all my bread ain't hardly done. If it were, I'd still be one brick shy of the number it takes to make up a load. My hair just died of jet lag, and I'm zipped inside my hanging bag. So check this bag of Nashville, Porter. God, I love the road. Oh, check this bag of Nashville, Porter Wagner quit the road.